okay friends uh, uh, this is a model of an eye that i made for a school project uh, i used all uh, the local material that is uh, is available in your local market near the house uh, for like uh, i used um, balls plastic balls simple plastic balls uh, to get this shape of uh, eyeball uh, then i have to use uh, two sizes of eyeballs uh, one that you see inside is is of this size this is a choroid of your eyeball so for that i used this as a mold then then i i took this i bought this white cement uh, white portland cement about 1 kilo and then i mixed uh, well with uh, uh, pva glue or uh, fevicol that we normally call and then and the result is is a quite strong quite strong molding then i painted with uh, oil colors it is with oil colors and you and here and there are some other parts like uh, the lens uh, the lens this is a real lens of glass uh, we uh, is used uh, for uh, the the specs or the glasses that we wear this is this is the real glass and to to m make you more uh, familiar with the eyeball uh, we can understand what is our eyeball uh, like uh, the eyeball eyeball this is a complete eyeball this goes here this is the irish and the top of okay make it clear okay this is the top half and then cross with it all this is a complete eyeball this is the eyeball okay now this uh, outer shell uh, outer part that is that uh, looks like white in color is called the sclera and we have uh, extrinsic muscles that control the movement of the eyeball actually two muscles are missing here one is the oblique superior oblique and the inferior oblique this is supposed to be the uh, left eye eyeball of a person okay so the sclera is the white part that is rich with uh, blood vessels and then you have muscles of course and then this uh, dark uh, pigmented part is the choroid 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 has got uh, three regions inside okay the one part which, which this is not a separate piece is, is normally has to be attached with uh, this one so the attached with the choroid this is the irish irish uh, is uh, it controls the size of this hole and that hole is called pupil that controls the amount of the light required and then uh, you have a lens this is cornea the front uh, transparent part of the eyeball and there is a lens that is supposed to sit here where is the lens a lens okay i have here okay this is oh this is the lens 
and I still have to make another part called uh, aqueous humor that fills the complete cavity of uh, the, the inner part of the eyeball that is the posterior part of the eyeball so choroid has got three regions as we said the first is the irish and then the lens that are attached with the, the ciliary body this is the part of the ciliary body I shaded with a little dark color this controls the the focal length of the lens uh, say like uh, if you're looking at a close object the ciliary body uh, expands and and gives a more clear vision to look for the near object and the shape is not complete like this eh? the inner part has got a lower circle and the outer part is little more con convex than the inner part so this is this is the shape of the lens and then when you see a uh, far away pro far you want to see the far objects the the ciliary body uh, they contract and when they contract it goes thinner and make you the image clear okay uh, this is how it works the ciliary body ciliary body helps to change the focal length of the lens then the the inner part this is the third part that is uh, uh, called retina okay retina is the is the very sensitive part of the eyeball where the all the image it gets focused on the area called phobius phobius centralis uh, phobius centralis is a is a is a point where is rich with cones yeah retina is made with rods and cones cones help us to understand colors and uh, rods understand objects in darkness when i want to see in a dark light i can rods help me to understand the object uh, this is how the retina works and all the signals are they carried away by the optical nerve optical nerve also when an object the when the the image is focused on retina or oh, sorry when the object is focused on on the, the optical nerves the point you can't see the object that is the blind spot we call it the blind spot and the the color images are detected at fabius centralis the signals are sent to the brain and brain interprets the image with colors and size so this is how the eye works actually i also built a digital model of our eye like i used uh, this is a face eh? a toy face okay and then i cut the half of the brain okay then i used uh, a mobile mobile then i took out the camera from its point I took out the point of the camera then the camera I fixed to one of it, the eye here is this camera and if I switch on okay now you see oh this is the image see so you can I put my fingers and see my fingers here yeah. this, this is the eyeball is a, is a good piece to present somebody to make understand how how the eye works this is this is optical nerves uh, for me yeah 
So this is how you can build your own uh, model of an eye and uh, you can present uh, and it's quite easy with all these stuffs available with uh, near your shop can do and we, I made a simple uh, base for this ah this is a bottle cap I had an empty bottle like this I cut here and I fixed down on the on the board so it becomes a good place for me yeah. see this is how you can make models of biological organs you can also try making lungs heart kidney you can do many things and it's quite simple thank you